Hey guys and welcome back to Daily Duel. So uh, I need to enable the sound and enable the music because that's not enabled and I accidentally did that. Anyway, uh, usually I'll have them turn off because we would usually be tagging but we are not tagging today because uh, I never got, been, was able to get in contact with Omega Chaos nor Slate. I was super busy and yeah. Uh, I guess I'll just take it all slow. I'm just gonna normal summon him and then at the end phase get, uh, um, uh, Amphispina. Yeah, just gonna take it all slow. Seems cool with me. Anyway, uh, as you can tell by the title, I'm going to go into regionals. I am going to the Las Vegas regionals in, like, I'm leaving out in like an hour and a half, so, uh, need to get everything recorded for both Saturday and Sunday. You know, I know, especially I'm doing Sunday just in case, you know, I'm out all day and then, you know, yeah, I don't want that to happen. More back row. More back row. One more. Is that a monster? Uh-huh. And then I'm gonna flip up this royal decree and you can go fuck yourself. <laughs> yep. Uh, I'm just gonna... I don't like that I've used multiple unicorns, but I guess it's okay. Yeah, I guess I'll just go ahead and take a slow. I don't know what we're facing today, but Royal Decree, whatever it is, Royal Decree helps. Alright, we'll go ahead and take Leo. Uh, Memphis Vina should be strong enough to run over whatever the hell that is. What could it possibly be? There's a ton of decks that are on an ass ton of back row. A set of monsters, is it Shadal's? Is it Shadals? But Shadals don't run that much back row, do they? Unless I don't know anything about Shadals and I'm about to go into this regionals and not know anything about Shadals. I don't remember them sending all that back row. Shadals are more monster reliant. Okay, well, thank you, but uh, yeah, Royal Decree. So sit the fuck down. It is Shadals. With an ass ton of back row. Did not know Shadals played that much back row. Dude, Royal Decree! Oh my god. Hello? What part of Royal Decree don't you fucking understand? This shit all is just, well, bad shit all is. Bad shit all is. Huh? Doesn't matter, I gotta attack it anyway. Wow, I actually got stopped by fucking Falco. I did not know that's not- Oh, you, uh, my bad, I got your attacking your D mixed up. Not bad. So let's just do this, you can talk about a monster on the field and destroy it. Actually, that might just be fine. I'm actually gonna exceed into plain coat so you can go ahead and flip and destroy me. I actually love that, I got the life points to pay. Go ahead. Flip, destroy me. I'm gonna get all them juicy effects. That's all I want is them juicy effects. I am totally good. Uh huh. Cool story, bro. Yeah. Mm hmm. Thanks. Your effect. Your effect. Send to what? To the graveyard. I'll go ahead and send the other unicorn and then uh, Amber Conway. And then, of course, I will be adding myself an Amphispina. So thanks for that. Totally didn't mind you, your mind your squad mod up. Not even remotely. I don't even care. This Dark Hole's kind of useless. Of course, I'm not gonna be throwing Dark Hole at him, but. Mm hmm. I don't think I have two wins in there, do I? Yeah, I have media. Oh, yeah, I do. Yes, I do. Cool. And I will go ahead and activate this. I need two wins, so I need you. And you. Awesome. So, going against a bad Shadal player. What, do you got something you want to play? One of the back rows? 
Love the Royal Decree. Favorite trap card in the game. Love that card. Everybody being so fucking back row reliant, Royal Decree just says, no, fuck you. I need Chidori. Fuck that, that. What, you wanna play one of your back row? Activate my effect, detach shield, put you back on the top of the deck this time, which I totally don't mind you being. I'll just deal with you later. Right now, I'm chill. And of course, I'll activate a unicorn, banish you to summon back my plane coat. I think that actually might be game. What's that? 22, 19, uh, is that 40, 41? What are you? 17. Oh, but I can just, I can just, um, discard, uh, Rolic to gain the attack points. Don't usually use this effect, but when I do, I should begin. Should begin. So, GG. Not really. Damn straight. Get on the one. Bear back. Alright, back again, and once again, I forgot to enable sound and music and stuff. Like, literally, I, like, I close it out, host another duel, and then I'm like, oh, I forgot to, uh, you know, turn the music on. And then by the time I remember and I want to close out the window and go ahead and do that and put it as default, it's already time for the next duel because my opponent already wants to duel me, so. So what could we possibly be facing today, uh? Something with a lot of back row, because like I said, Yu-Gi-Oh, a lot of back row. Ton of it. And face face me? No? no? Okay. Was it Shadals again? Because I know everybody and their mother is using Shadals. Wow, he's just going to end his turn. Nah. How about we play with no traps? Oh, you did have the MST. You just didn't want to blind space it. If I Exiton right now, I'd have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, because 1, 2, 3, 4, well, we'd be even. Oh, fuck it. I gotta play Yu-Gi-Oh anyway. Fuck it. Apparently. Mm-hmm. Who could it possibly be? Oh, it's a mirror match. Not know that. Why do you like back row so much? Ah. I'll just set this and end my turn. I'm cool. So you must have just had an ass hand to play Amber Conway like that. Hmm. Like I said, no back row. Wiretap. All right. Oh god, this guy does not want me to play around a green, not at all. <sighs> yeah, it's worth summoning this. Because if something happens, I can always play Heraldry out. Jungle? Any response at all? No? Okay, fine. I'll get the damage in. Damage is worth it. You better use that back row, that better be like a mirror force or something. Took all that damage. Yeah, I'm up on resources. Even if I exit, I'll still be up on resources, so I guess I'll go ahead and go into you. Blackhorn? Blackhorn. 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 Bottomless. Okay. I don't know why you didn't bottomless before, but I guess I didn't summon anything that was bottomless the bowl. Dude, what the fuck? <coughs> hey, this is why you don't play like an ass ton of back row. Uh, let's see, 3,100 and then make a cowboy, so that should be game. So, it literally will come down to that back row. You better have something. 
That's fine. I don't play it. I don't care if you next to me. I've been in this duel anyway. Unless that back row or something stopped me. I hope it is. It wasn't last turn. Be a cowboy? Yeah. See what happens when you try to be a dick? You not allow me to play with the Royal Creek? Bang. <coughs> Alright, we can get another duel in. Bear right back. Alright, I got it this time. So, yes, going to regionals, Las Vegas regionals. Uh, I did not get the cards that I wanted to get for the rest of my deck to be pure Constellers. So, I am going with uh, Constellar Knights. So, yay, Constellar Knights. And, uh, uh I got a uh, first turn uh, hand, which is totally fine. I don't mind going first turn hand. In case shit hits the fan, I still got another uh, advance, so. so I'll just go for a hand. Give me a hand. Alright? Good. So, what are we going against? Back row, back row, back row, back row. Alright, go we'll start, bro. Another rank up. Okay. And we'll just attack you then. Wow, what the hell with people just playing ass tons of back row and not playing any monsters? Like, hello? Like, are we actually gonna duel, or what? If you activate anything, I gotta negate it. It's mandatory, so... Maybe that's why you set the back row? I don't know. Once again, another duel where my opponent just has an ass ton of back row, but doesn't play anything. Mirror Force, I have to negate. Shut the fuck up, and take this attack. Everything. Everything. When a card or effect is activated, I have to negate it. Mm-hmm. Oh, read him. Alright, I will go ahead and send uh, you. Get out of here. That was actually a maybe chance pop up in the sky too late now. Send you and you. You go ahead and get your effect. Get me an emphasis Bina. I'm still good. That's the funny thing, I'm still good. I think I actually, depending on whose back row is, I still might win this duel, because I'm just going to go ahead, bring my thing back with Unicorn, rank up into uh, C101, take his Redum. And I said, that still might be good. Rank up. To C101. Rock. Activate. Give me that. Then I'll run over this. Unless you got another mirror force. Nope. Okay. <laughs> uh, then I'll set the right out of cray. And face space. No? Okay. I thought some of them would be space. That would be something. So I literally just shut down your major ass play. Mm-hmm. No. We're good. We don't need you to call it haunted anything. So you better chain that. Oh, it was another call to haunted. Alright. Oh, here comes M7. Which is totally fine. Because I could just go either way Herald or Reborn, summon, get out of my face attack. So it's still game. It's still game. I still got you. I said I could read your plays like a fucking book, but I still got you. Oh yeah, activate my effect. I love activating my effect. You. And, uh... I guess you. You will go off. Go ahead and give me you. I said I'm still golden. Unless that one card is something to freaking beat me. Thanks. 
that's it. That is it. GG. And I'm gonna activate the Chronology thing. I don't need to. I don't need to activate the advance. He's gonna summon you. XC right until 101? Yeah, 101. Doesn't matter. Castell 101 doesn't matter. Game anyway. Two. Gimme. And attack. Still would have been over sooner if you didn't have that second call of the haunted. But it's cool. Ah, oh, I don't have enough time to get another duel in. Anyway, going to regional, I'm using Castellar Knight. Uh, pretty much the, the deck that I did the deck profile on, that's what I'm taking. Uh, of course, with the traps done uh, and the breakthrough skill that I was missing. But uh, the vanities, I might still be missing the, the third one. I'm not sure if my friend who has the vanities uh, that he's going to let me use it is uh, going. So if not, then I'm just going to replace it with a Grand Mole. Because Grand Mole's pretty good against Shadal. It's just attack, you don't get flipped, bounce it back. Attack, you don't get flipped, bounce it back. So oop. so I'll probably be taking, uh, I mean, yeah, I'm taking that. And like I said, if I don't get that third vanities, I'll just go with the Grand Mole. And I'm just going to scout it and see how it is. I mean, I get 20 packs for... I mean, I get 20 packs. I get 5 packs for $20. And of course, I'll go ahead and do an opening of those packs. So you can go ahead and see that. So that's cool. Um, that's a live video right there. Um, and then I'm just going to go ahead and try my luck. I got the side deck, the extra deck. So I'm pretty chill. It's just not the deck that I wanted to go with. I wanted to go with my Pierre Constellers. Uh, I, the cards that I ordered were Doom Caliber Knights. But they never came in the mail in time. They'll probably come in the mail at while I'm at regionals. So it sucks. But uh, what you're going to do. So going with Constellar Knights. So I'm just going to go ahead and see how it does. If the deck will work okay with them put together. Huh. I am citing the Royal Decrees definitely because ass ton of back row is my weakness, especially against Burning Abyss, because Burning Abyss is just Yeah. I swear to god, Burning Abyss is like seriously just back row, back row, back row. So yeah, no thank you. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. So uh like I said I apologize to Slater Mega Cast for not getting in contact with you. Super busy on Friday, uh Pretty much I had to do record for both Saturday and Sunday. I didn't even get done. It's because this is actually Saturday. And this is going up on Saturday. So I didn't get done. And then I had to uh, go out with friends and record some more uh, uh, Daniel and Friends play. And also, uh, apparently, for uh, Dragon Ball Z League, uh, I'm also the West Kai tester for the on-season as well. No one informed me. Literally, on Dragon Ball Z League forums, they literally made a form. And they're like, your tester is... You will master you. And then people started making requests. I didn't even know the form existed. Like, how come no one informs me of this shit? No one told me, hey, you're still the tester. Like, I thought it was just a tester for the off season, but apparently they still want me to test be the tester for the for the season, which is should be still fine. Um, they don't get full bills, they only get AI tests. And the funny thing is, is that they were requesting they were requesting tests for AIs, no builds. You can't do builds anymore, just AIs. And it's like I gave them I gave each team on the West Kai a hundred tests plus and you still need to get testing done like oh my god i guess but you know season starting uh sunday if i'm hopefully if i'm if i either a didn't go to regionals or something like that on sunday i will go ahead and post a video up on the channel informing everybody that dragon ball z league is up on twitch and if you want to come and watch it you can so you know you know like how like if you guys are subscribed to shofu how shofu does It'll put up, or like Northern Lion, or uh, Uber Hexer Nova. And they'll put up a video and be like, hey, on Twitch. So, yeah, I'll go ahead and put up one of those kind of videos and be like, hey, Dragon Ball League on Twitch. You want to come and watch it? More power to you if you don't. You don't have to. Go ahead and cheer on the booze for us, because, you know, I want the booze to do really well. It's just the preseason, so it doesn't officially count. It's just kind of like practice. So, preseason week one, preseason week two, and then we start season six. So, yeah. And it's every week on Sundays. Um, it's, uh, I think it's like, what, 4 p.m. Pacific time, 2 p.m. Eastern, no, 1 p.m. Eastern time, uh, mountain time, whatever time. So, just, just, it's 4 p.m. East and Pacific time. So, just go on Google, type in 4 p.m. Eastern time, convert it to whatever time you, you, you have, and that's what it'll be. But there will be a video uploaded to my channel, so you can go ahead and see it. Anyway. Uh, yeah, that's it. Going into regionals. Wish me luck. Uh, I will, of course, give you guys a tournament report. Uh, I already gave you a de deck profile, so I don't have to do that. But, yeah. Alright, so. Oh, I guess I could still do the side deck, but eh. Alright, so I hope that you guys. Because the, the side deck is still subject to change. I literally just jimmy the side deck together, so it might not even work, but eh, we'll find out. So, 
Anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Uh, starting with Stanzi, which I already recorded ahead of time, as of this video's upload. So at least I don't have to do that. And of course, using Quacky Miro. I took out the three axes, so now it's just uh, you know, for, you know, bear, gorilla, uh, wolf bark, stuff like that. So yeah. All right. Thanks for watching.